everybody, I'm Scientist Charlie, and today I have no experiment. You see kids, electricity is very dangerous, and we shouldn't play with it. So instead of an experiment, I have a very important guest to interview. Please welcome Benjamin Franklin! Hello there, Benny! Hello there, Charlie, and hello there, children! Can I call you Benny? I suppose that's all right. Great! So, Benny, what do you know about electricity? Well, Charlie, I conducted many experiments in my lifetime to learn all about electricity. A very famous experiment I did was to prove that lightning is electricity. So, how'd you prove it, Benny boy? During a thunder and lightning storm, I took a kite and flew it outside. What? You flew a kite during a thunderstorm? Ha <laughs> ha! That is so silly. That's not all I did. I took a metal key and tied it to the kite before I flew it. You tied a key? To a kite! The devil! <laughs> oh, you should be a stand-up comedian! That doesn't make any sense! That's not all. I took a thin metal wire and tied one end of the wire to the key and the other end to a Leyden jar. A Leyden jar is a container for storing an electrical charge. You could say this was an early type of battery. <laughs> A key to a kite! Uh, a jar is part of a battery! <laughs> Charlie, these aren't jokes. I did this experiment to show that lightning could be transferable from the key and captured into the Leyden jar. I successfully proved that lightning is electricity. <laughs> wait, 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 what? You see, the electric energy of the storm charged the metal wire and the electricity transferred in the jar. I even got a little shock when I touched the key. Wait a second. We brought you on this show because we thought the lightning struck the key. Actually, that is a common misconception that the lightning hit the key. The energy in the storm charged the wire. I was very lucky that the lightning didn't strike the key. If it did, I would have gotten seriously hurt. Just look at this picture of a tree struck by lightning. Yikes! Wowza! Yes, lightning is very powerful. I even invented the lightning rod to keep buildings safe when struck by lightning. Really? Yes. The taller the building, the more at risk it becomes to being hit by lightning. Without a lightning rod, uh -huh. a building struck by uh -huh. lightning could catch on fire. A oh, lightning yeah? rod is somewhat similar to my key experiment. What? You see, we place a metal rod to the top of the building with a metal wire that runs down to the ground. These rods attract the lightning and let the electricity run down to the ground, keeping the building safe. Wow. You are incredible, Benny Franklin! Ah, oh, thank you, Charlie. We can all be curious about the world. That is so true. Bye now! Wait, what? Whoa, who knew? Cool! Click on my video, it's so fun! Wait, 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 <laughs> what were you telling them no? Click on my video, it's crump -tastic. I did a pun. <laughs> Ew, no, gross! Click my video, guys, it's the best! What? Oh, the best? The best to puke at? Blah! Blah! Ugh.